welcome back to my channel you guys you're back with a new video today i am going to show you how i meal prep for the week so this is going to be perfect if you are like me and you're a lazy little bitch um and you're busy during the week and you don't like to put a lot of effort into cooking i hate cooking i absolutely despise it i think it's a waste of time and energy and i try to make my life easy so if you are busy if you are lazy and you like to uh, eat healthy efficiently then just keep on watching let me show you what i got and then we're gonna get cooking first thing rice i hate cooking rice so i get microwave rice it's ready in 90 seconds and uh doesn't get much better than that and then i got some uh veggies broccoli and carrots i also got some more quest bars these are a great snack i get this uh gorilla protein pasta really like it some quick oats for uh, overnight oats for breakfast unsweetened vanilla almond milk for said overnight oats frozen shrimp that's already peeled Two bags of microwave green beans. I have in here two fillets of salmon. And then the last thing that I get is this Italian style chicken sausage. Okay, so just to tell you the plan really quick, um, what I'm planning on making is overnight oats for breakfast. And then for lunch, I'm gonna do uh, the salmon and then green beans and rice and then the salmon is only gonna last me two days, so that's why I bought the shrimp. And then for the rest of the week, I'll do the shrimp and then the green beans and the rice. And then for dinners, I'm gonna make the protein pasta with some chicken sausage in there and then these veggies. So yeah, the first thing I'm going to do, so the first thing I'm gonna do is preheat to 375. And that's gonna be for the veggies. Well, it's gonna be for the broccoli and carrots. I like to roast my broccoli and carrots um, and then the green beans I'm gonna steam. So that's going to heat up. Okay, so while that's heating up, I'm going to start heating up my pan so I can cook my salmon real quick. Okay, so I am heating up my pan and I just seasoned my salmon with just some salt and then like garlic parsley seasoning thing. And I have a pot of water that I'm gonna wait for boil. So um, the next thing I'm gonna do is prepare my uh, broccoli and carrots. So let's do that real quick. Alrighty, so I poured them all out in here. I'm going to take some of this al uh, olive, no, avocado oil, spray it all on there. Then I'm gonna use the same um, garlic parsley seasoning um, that I used on the salmon and sprinkle some of that on there. And then I'm gonna take my Trader Joe's Everyday Seasoning and do some of that. Give it a good toss. Now that's ready to go into the oven once the oven is ready. All right, so my pan that I'm gonna cook the salmon on is uh, quite warm now, so I put it on like low, medium heat. Um, and now I'm just gonna put my salmon fillets on there and set a timer for seven minutes, and it's gonna cook for seven minutes on each side, so. All right, so I have the timer going, my salmons are on there, so I'm gonna check back in seven minutes and flip them over. Okay, so while those are cooking, I'm gonna start making my overnight oats. So when I make my overnight oats, I don't like to make them for the whole week. I just, I make them like a couple days like in advance because I don't, I don't know, I just don't like them too soft. It's, it's a personal preference. And also I only have two of these little containers, so whatever, it works for me. So, so for this, I'm gonna use my oats. I don't buy anything fancy. This is just a cheap option, so yeah. In addition to the oats, I also add collagen protein, I add chia seeds, monk fruit sweetener, some vanilla extract, and then obviously I like to use my
my uh, unsweetened vanilla almond milk. So the first step, I like to measure out half a cup of the oats and put that into each container, followed by two scoops of my collagen powder. After that, I go in with just about a tablespoon-ish of chia seeds, and then almost a full tablespoon of the monk fruit sweetener. I don't follow exact measurements, sorry. Not really sorry. Then I give them a good mix. And then after I mix them together, I add my almond milk. I usually do just a little bit over half a cup, probably it's about three quarters, and then I add a splash of vanilla extract right after that, mix them all together, and then voila, that's done. Okay, so I have my overnight oats all prepped now. <laughs> <coughs> Jesus, sorry. And it was perfect timing because now my oven is uh, already preheated and my water is boiling. So we're gonna put these in the oven. And I'll set a timer for like 30 minutes. And then I keep an eye on it um, and just like take it out or leave it in however, like much longer if I feel like it needs it. So yeah. like just a little more than half of the box yeah i don't know i'm like a really bad judge of uh quantity when it comes to cooking pasta so i kind of just wing it and it usually works out then so i'm just gonna do a little more than half the box since i'm cooking for the week so yeah so the next thing that i'm gonna do is start preparing the sausage that way i can just add it to the pasta when it's done and so these are already cooked so all i'm going to do is heat it up in a pan all right guys, so the sausage is on the stove. I'm going to cook each of the four links individually and then cut them up when it's done and then add it to the pasta. Um, and I just, I'm cooking it like, according to the package instructions. So yeah, not really putting too much thought into that. And then yeah, so everything for the pasta is cooking. The salmon is done. All right, so this is what it looks like. Um, yeah, it's essentially done. It's cooked through, it smells real good. And I'm getting the notification that my battery is about to die, so I'm going to charge it real quick and then um, show you guys the rest on my phone. So yeah, let's switch really quick. So uh, let me show you what I did. All right, so my salmon finished. So all I did was microwave this rice. Um, literally, you just microwave it for 90 seconds. And I, um, so one packet is one serving, but it's too much for me. So I split it into half and divided it into you know these things. And so I just put the salmon on top of that. I also had my pasta finished, so I just divided it up into five separate containers. And so what I'm going to do now is microwave these green beans and then start cooking the shrimp. And I'm going to use the same pan to cook the shrimp that I cooked my salmon in. And I'm just going to add like the same seasonings and stuff. So i um, really uh, not putting too much thought into it and just keeping it simple. So yeah. Okay guys, so quick little update. I have completely finished the salmon. This is what it looks like. I um, added the green beans and then I also added the green beans to some of the like pasta and sausage that I made. The vegetables that were in the oven are done and came out and I have also divided them up into the remainder of my little pasta dishes. And so the last thing that I have cooking is the shrimp and I think just about like five more minutes they should be done. All right, so this is how it's looking right now. It's still like not all pink. So once this is done, I'm going to cook the remainder of my rice, which is right here, and then also microwave this, and then those will be on their own. All right, you guys, everything is finished. So as you can see, I placed the shrimp, the rice, and the remainder of my green beans into the last of my meal prep containers. The shrimp is really easy. I literally just put salt and that garlic parsley seasoning that I used earlier on the shrimp. And then I just microwaved the rice and then the green beans. This is everything. Now just to let it cool off and then I will put it in the fridge. So yeah, everything took probably right underneath an hour. I mean, it's like 12.30 almost and I started at about 11.30. So it was really quick and easy. Now I got lunch and dinner for the rest of the week and then I got breakfast as well. So yeah, um, <laughs> it was honestly 
really easy. So if you guys like this video, please uh, give it a like. So with that being said, I will see you guys in the next one. Bye.